What you guys got for me? What's going through your mind right now after this one? Uh, it's definitely a frustrating loss. Um, you know, one that, um, you know, we could have had, I think, that first half, you know, falling behind. Um, we could have avoided that, but I like how we fought back. We gave ourselves an opportunity to win, and um, it's just unfortunate that it didn't turn out that way. What's just kind of the mood of this team right now, knowing you guys got to dig yourselves out a little bit of a hole now? Yeah, obviously, um, you know, it's a tough loss. It's, um, you know, especially when it comes down to a field goal or we're going to overtime and um, the way we kind of battle back, it makes it, you know, a lot tougher. But um, it's a long season. There's a lot more games to be played, a lot of um, improvements that we can make. And um, we just got to move on to the next game. We can't let this game, um, you know, work its way into the next week. Would you see improved or work tonight, Bobby, defensively? Um, I felt we did a better job in, in uh, pass coverage. You know, I think they um, – Tried DJ a couple of times down the middle. Um, you know, I think we were really good in tackling. Um, we got off the field. Um, I think our numbers was like five and fourteen, uh, something like that, on um, third down, which is is huge for us. So, you know, we had some improvements, but um, you know, we have to do more. We got to find a way to get the ball. Um, you know, put our offense in better positions. There's a lot of stuff that that we can do better. That we can. Um, they're easy fixes, and um, we'll get it done. Um, he did great, man. You know, we, we talked a little bit before, um, you know, going out to the game and, you know, I just told him play free. Um, I, I know it was a long time ago, but I still remember being a rookie and there's a lot going on in your head and, um, you know, you don't want to try to do too much, but, you know, he had a really big tackle, um, on that third down, you know, where a guy could have got a first down had he not, uh, broke so quick. So. Um, I'm excited to see him kind of grow and get more opportunities to play, and it's going to be fun to watch him play. He said you helped him a lot through just the injury situation of being out, kind of the frustration there or whatever. What kind of advice were you giving him while he was waiting to get healthy? Um, I just recall my, I think it was my third year, uh, I think I had a foot injury that kept me out like five weeks or something like that. Um, and there's a lot go through your mind, a lot of stuff that, um, you know, a lot of the times we try to we think so much about the future that we don't uh, pay attention to the moment. So really, I was just trying to tell them to be present. And, you know, to me, whenever you get hurt, there's something that you're supposed to focus on and, and there's something that you're supposed to get better at. So I just told him to find that and focus on that and get right. And when his time is um, when he's ready and healthy to play, um, he'll be better than what he was before the injury. So, um, yeah. Bobby, bigger picture, you guys haven't been 2 and 4, I don't think, since you've been here. You haven't been without Russell. How do you just process the entire state of things right now? Um, <clears throat> at the end of the day, we just got to win. You know, I think today we gave ourselves an opportunity to win. Um, it's unfortunate it didn't turn out our way, but um, there was a lot of things that we improved. Um, even on offensively, you saw the second half, we were able to move the ball. And so if we can put that together for four quarters, um, I think we'll be good. We just got to um, do our jobs and and execute the right way and, you know, hold it, hold it down until Russ gets back. Is it on your mind at all that a lot of the young guys in the locker room are going to be looking to you and how you carry yourself going forward to dig out of this hole? I mean, I always uh, – I'm, I'm pretty much the same, man. You know, never too high, never too low. So, um, you know, if they're looking at me, I'll give them everything they need to get through this. This is – there's a lot more, you know, worse positions to be in. I think we have a great opportunity to win these next two games, and winning next two games, and going to the bye week. Um, you know, feeling feeling better than what we are right now. His coaching style and how optimistic he is, even when things are not going well. Do you, do you think that serves you guys well right now with the situation you're in? I think you have to be, because if if you go in and you get down and you come in and and um, you know everybody's moping around, everybody has bad energy. That's the type of stuff that carries into the next game. And so we can't have that, you know, carry into the next game. We got to, um, you know, really feel this loss, um, go back to the drawing board, look at the, the things that we could have done better, and then come Tuesday or Wednesday, whatever it is, we got to let it go and we got to focus on the next opponent. And we have to come out and we have to win that game. And once we win that game, we got to win the next one and just, you know, try to put a, you know, strengths and wins together. What have you thought of the two times Gino's been out there for you guys? Um, I thought he did well. I thought he had under pressure well. There's a lot. I mean, you know, filling a guy like Russell's shoes is, is not an easy task for anybody. So 
Um, you know, whenever something happens, everybody's the first thing you're going to do is is compare to what Russell would have done. And so um, that's a lot of pressure. But for him to have that type of pressure and come back and be as, as poised as he was, you know, in that second half and, and give us an opportunity to win the game, um, you know, it's something that you can respect and something that you, I feel like he can grow and we can uh, move forward into next season just or next uh, game and really build off that. Thank you, Bobby. Good. Appreciate it.